as soon as I got on the stage, saw the audience, saw the reaction, it was absolutely amazing. <laughs> Oh, it was just so much fun. It was like electric, the energy. It was so nice to perform together. We got a lot of laughs as well. My friend couldn't tie his shoelaces properly, so I sent him to boot camp. <laughs> well, I'm quite excited, really, because this is our first production show that's specifically for our second years. So what we decided to do was something that was all singing, all dancing, but incorporate acting as well and costumes. Mothers, how come there are three of you? You were a three-man job. <laughs> So we've got Andrew Cleary, one of our fantastic lecturers, and he's devised the first half, which is a choral and dance extravaganza. But he's also acted as musical director for the pantomime in the second half. Give me a cheer! I'm Harry, I'm one of the creative team behind the pantomimes. I'm actually the writer and director of the Cinderella part, along with Chloe as well, in the process of developing the idea of a Christmas spectacular. Bigger faces. I think it's made me more creative, it's made me more confident and more passionate. Looking at it from a director's perspective whilst you're performing is so unbelievably difficult, but I think it's definitely pushed me in the right ways. I've learned so much from this experience. Stuff you can do out of your comfort zone, something that you'd never think you would ever imagine doing. It's helped me gain confidence in really embodying my character and really helped with audience participation and me playing off energies. I am very proud of everyone in the room today. It went really, really well. The audiences have loved it. Really, really good feedback and lots of high hopes for the future that hopefully next year and for the years to go on, this will be recreated and that we sort of started a bit of a tradition, a bit of something special, so yeah.